Welcome to API Connect Test and Monitor. This video is a quick overview that will show you how to create, publish and schedule your first test. Once you log into the product, you'll be presented with this screen, which is the HTTP client. And this is where we're going to get started. Choose your HTTP method and enter your request endpoint. You can also add parameters that will define the request headers and body, but in this demonstration, my endpoint doesn't require these. Then simply hit send. You'll be presented with the request headers and body, both in a raw and parsed format. Now we're going to create a test from this request and response. Click the generate test button, give your test a name and choose which project you'd like to assign it to. Then click the tick and wait for the magic to happen. Click close and now you're in the test composer. Here you can see all of the elements which make up the test you've just generated. Then click the run test button to run the test. This will generate a test report which will show you if the test passed, the number of failures there were and other key information. Once you're happy with the test, save and exit from the test composer. Now you'll be taken to the test status page. Here you can see that the test is currently in the draft stage, so the next step is to publish it. Once you've done this, your working copy will become your published version and you'll be able to set up scheduled runs for it. You won't be able to schedule runs of your test if you don't have a published version. To schedule a run, Go to the schedule page and click create new run. Give your new schedule run a name, select an agent and choose when you want it to run, then save it. You'll see it now appearing in your schedules list. If you return to the tests page, you can run the test from here and check that everything's working successfully. For more information and other documentation, go to ibm.biz forward slash API test.